This brand new product from Electrovoice may be the perfect addition to your mobile DJ rig. Hey everybody, this is Steve from Electrovoice with Musical Yours and Digital DJ Gear. And today we're here to talk to you about our first battery powered speaker, the Everse 8. Before we get started, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you like our content. The Everse 8 is designed for mobile DJs, musicians, and event production. The Everse 8 is housed in a polypropylene enclosure. It is equipped with a one inch titanium dome tweeter and an eight inch woofer. It packs 400 watts of power bi amped. The frequency response is from 50 hertz to 20 kilohertz, and it comes in at less than 17 pounds. The Everse 8 comes in at an IP43 rating, which means it's protected against an object larger than one millimeter and against water spray at a 60 degree angle. This IP43 rating means a lot when doing your gig. If you're outside during a wedding ceremony and it begins to rain, this item will be protected against such inclement weather. The Everse 8 ships with this weather cover. It is simply removed by pulling down on the top there is a rubber ring around the outside. You simply put it up to the unit and press it firmly on the back. When this weather cover is attached, it provides the full IP43 rating when streaming music through the unit. The Everse 8 comes equipped with a lithium ion battery. It is mounted right in here inside the unit. It is easily removed by these two thumb screws. The battery life on the lithium ion battery at 95 dB is over 12 hours. And at maximum output of 121 dB. Yes, 121 dB. 121 dB. The battery power lasts for over six hours. It is easily charged by connecting your IEC cable into the back of the unit while the battery is inside and it will be fully charged in less than four hours. The Everse 8 has four inputs. You have a XLR and TRS input on channel one and two, and then channel three and four is for Bluetooth streaming, as well as a 3.5 millimeter or 1 8 inch auxiliary jack. On channel one, you have the option for 48 volt phantom power, and on channel two, you have a high Z, which eliminates the need for a direct box when using a guitar or bass. You have a mix out option, which allows you to send your audio into another speaker, or if you're connecting an external subwoofer, such as our ELX 212 SP or ELX 218 SP. We also have preset crossover modes built into the unit for utilizing our subwoofers with the Everse 8. There is a foot switch quarter inch jack. If you are doing a performance and you have effects on your instrument or your vocal, using a single button foot switch, once you engage that, it will turn the effect off that is being sent to channel one and two to provide clarity when speaking back to the audience. There is a USB-C port that could be utilized to charge your mobile device, tablet or phone. There is the IEC port, again, for powering the unit and or charging the battery. And lastly, a 12 volt output. This would be used in ideal situation of connecting a wireless receiver, such as the Electrovoice RE3 or the Electrovoice R300. You have no need to bring additional power cables to power that wireless receiver. You could also even use that to power a pedal board or any other device that accepts 12 volts. The master knob, just like all of our other products that you're probably familiar with, you simply push and that allows you to access the DSP inside the unit simply by turning the knob. Additionally, we have soft keys for the inputs. By tapping that soft key, it lights up and then allows you to again push the master knob and access the DSP and EQ associated with that specific channel. 
The Everse 8 can be controlled wirelessly. And if you're familiar with other products such as EOX 200 and the Evolve series, you're probably familiar with the EV Quick Smart mobile app that can be downloaded both in the Apple Store and the Google Play Store. That app can be used to control the DSP of the unit as well as to mix wirelessly. The Everse 8 is Bluetooth streamable. It has a Bluetooth 5.0 chip and you are able to link two Everse 8 units together without any cabling to stream in true full stereo. The Everse 8 has three different positions you can utilize. Tripod mode, 55 degree monitor mode, and 30 degree kickback mode. All three orientations have DSP selections. Now I'm gonna give you a quick preview of how loud this thing can really get. We're gonna start very low at about 10% of the output. Bringing it to about 20. 30. Forty, and now we're at about 50%. And the only way to really hear it through Sandman is about 100%, especially when it kicks in. We're gonna pop this up to about 55, 60%. Gonna bring it to about 70. was really loud. <laughs> Music ducking is great because it allows you to address the audience without creating too much interruption in the background music. Now we're going to show you a quick demo of the ducking feature, which is adjustable by up to 12 dB. Your sweet, sweet love. It's Will everyone please make their way to the main reception hall as cocktail hour will be ending in 15 minutes. And in my how many times are you at a gig and the person has no idea how to hold a microphone and they're just waving it around in front of the speaker and causing a bunch of feedback? Well, by engaging the automatic feedback suppression, you can simply hold the microphone up to the unit. It will provide up to 12 notch filters to eliminate any unwanted frequencies. And in about 30 seconds or so, there is no more feedback. You could do this when you first get to the gig to ensure that these issues will not be present during your application. The Everse is available in both black and white and retails for $749. So there you have it, the new Everse 8 from ElectroVoice is a versatile and powerful option for any mobile application. Please subscribe to the channel for more information on all your DJ products. We hope you enjoyed this video from Digital DJ Gear and Musical.ly Yours. To learn more about all of our pro audio, lighting, DJ and recording equipment, please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to our YouTube channel now. Be sure to leave a comment below if this video helped you and check out these other videos we think you'll like. Until next time, thanks for watching.